Well, the calls are getting louder for Attorney General Eric Holder to appoint a special prosecutor to investigate the IRS targeting scandal. Two high-ranking Republicans have now sent him a letter demanding that he take action immediately, insisting it's not only the right thing to do, but it is the law. Chris Dyerwalt is our Fox News digital politics editor. Chris, so who are the two Republicans and what, you know, we've heard calls for a special prosecutor before, including from Daryl Issa on this show last week. Why is it, why, is the, why are they more important? Well, they're, I, I, I won't ruffle any feathers and say they're more important, but I will say that this is sort of a signal moment. Bob Goodlatte, uh, who is a Virginia Republican in charge of the Judiciary Committee, Fred Upton, uh, who uh, deals with taxation issues, uh, the IRS, a little oversight there, Republican from Michigan. Uh, these guys are, they're no schmoes. Well, these Dave are, Camp. It's Dave Camp. Or from Dave Michigan. Camp. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Dave Camp. He's no schmo either. Uh, <laughs> these, are, these, are, these are serious people. Uh, they have not... They have not been out calling for everybody's impeachment or anything like that. Uh, these are measured people who are part of the process, and they're high in leadership. So this is them saying, you've got to do something about this. The problems with the IRS are too significant, and the response from the administration has been inadequate. And basically, they're not accusing them of... Uh, uh, obstructing the law, but what they're accusing them of doing is not being forthcoming and not doing what they're supposed to do, which is seek the truth. What, you know, with the, um, with Benghazi, John Boehner resisted and resisted and, res and resisted having a select committee until that one email came out, and that was the straw that broke the camel's back, and finally he said, I, gi I give up, let's do it. I is that the way the IRS investigation is likely to go? I mean, Eric Holder is no John Boehner. <laughs> The uh, no, that that that's that's fair. Uh, the uh, this administration, Republicans have been going broke for years, betting on their ability to shame this administration into action. This administration is unshameable, at least by these Republicans, when it comes to doing things about investigations, criminal wrongdoing, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. In fact, I might even submit that this is part of an administration strategy, which says the crazier, the angrier, the madder they can make Republicans about things like I don't know, targeting the president's enemies through. Uh, a, 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 an unloved uh, entity in the Internal Revenue Service, the worse the better. And they like to push the Republicans, they like to tweak them, they like to refuse. Fast and furious, we remember executive privilege, blanket drops in and the president protects Holder. Uh, and they have been stonewalling on the IRS on, on several fronts. They've never had a real special prosecutor do, uh, and they don't want one. Do they have something up their sleeve? You know, is there going to be another shoe to drop in this IRS investigation? Well, there's a couple shoes out there, and the Republicans in the House have a shoe, uh, and that shoe is they have some more details, I am told from folks on the Hill, that they could use to pressure. You remember when the Lois, Learn when the Lois Lerner emails came out, that created a little wave? Well, there may be a few more waves out there that might make Eric oh. Holder want to get going. Chris Steyerwalt, not a schmo. Not a schmo, not usually. See you. <laughs>